What's up guys and welcome back to Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2 and today we're going to be going ahead and checking out a brand new pack in the sticker shop. Now you might remember the adverse like opposite of this but today we're going to be showing off the, where is it? Well we got a lot of packs in the store at this point. Boss Hunt Zombie Reinforcement Pack for 20,000 coins. Of course we did show off the plant reinforcement packs earlier in the year when we were doing a plant boss hunt against the Yeti King but right now you might know that there is the Gnomus Brothers they are back, and if you want to see a video on them, check out the video too. A few days ago, I actually posted another Brothers Gnomus video. Not only that, but this Sunday, so tomorrow, I plan on streaming the boss hunt with viewers here on YouTube. That's the plan. Hopefully, it works out. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and spend 20,000 coins a couple times on these zombie reinforcement packs to let you guys know if they are worth it or not, because the plant reinforcement packs, as I've talked about, I actually um, deem them very much worth it. So we're gonna go ahead and find out if these ones are worth it as well. Now, so far, these look exactly the same as the plant reinforcement packs. They're 20,000 coins. They guarantee nine common, rare, or super rare consumable items. And why you would buy this over something like the Minions Booster Pack is if you just won zombie bots for the boss fight, you're going to be spending extra cash and the plant pots might be getting in the way and you might not get as many zombie bots. You end up might spending more coins at the end of the day. So if you only want zombie bots, you buy the zombie reinforcement pack. So that's exactly where we're going to go in the gonna go ahead and do and hopefully we get some decent pots here I mean really the main things I look for in these are going to be stuff like mr. Toasty's pretty good hide and shoots really good loudmouth is pretty decent and mr. Electro and mr. toxic are okay but dr. heels will be super duper important especially if you're not right next to your local scientist player or maybe everybody was silly and nobody chose a scientist dr. heels are gonna try to bust you out of some bad situations so a lot of these are pretty good there aren't really that many bad zombie bats so really just getting a good chunk in general you get nine of them and those nine might have like multiple so you're getting nine different cards but as you can see it's times three times three times three times three so um like this one we got times five but if we assume yeah like so we had 27 28 29 bots out of that one twenty thousand coin pack in total so that's pretty crazy um it's more than you know a bot per thousand coins which of course i think most people would expect that but i mean really you 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 know get exactly what you're looking for with the zombie bots and I feel like that's why it might be slightly more expensive than if you bought the normal 2500 pack because of the fact that you are also getting yourselves guaranteed items you're not getting you know the stuff that you don't want which might be plant pots of course if you're up to getting anything go ahead and buy the minion booster pack but if you're struggling with this boss hunt and you really need plant pots of course I would go ahead and recommend getting this now like I said I'm already doing videos on the uh, brothers gnomus boss hunt I've done them back when the Brothers Nomus first came around back in November, covering all of the difficulties. But yeah, I'm glad to see all of these different plant pots, but of course, in the reinforcements for the plants, you guys actually gave me your opinion. Some of you said this wasn't worth it. So of course, you guys can let me know your opinions in the comment section, because when it comes to you know spending your hard-earned in-game money, it's all about opinions, so make sure you read some of the opinions in the comment section below and share your own. Blah, talking is difficult. <laughs> But yeah, if you want to see Gnomus Brothers videos, make sure you check the comments down below. I'll be sure to link a few if you're having a hard time defeating them. And possibly stay tuned until tomorrow, and I might be able to play some with viewers, and that'll be nice and fun. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video on Plants vs. Zombies, Garden Warfare 2. If you did, make sure to give this video a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watched this point of the video, make sure you comment reinforced to Zebra so any you've watched in the video, and you are a Zebra-tastic. By the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.